There are a number of ways to download and upload projects to and from the Maple Systems 5000 series HMIs. It is important to know the specific download upload capabilities for your model and to follow the correct download upload process. To begin, find your HMI model in the table. The table lists the download upload options available for each HMI model. As you can see, some HMIs have multiple options available and others have only one. In this video I will explain the process for downloading and uploading to and from your 5000 series HMI using an Ethernet cable. The Ethernet cable is used to download and upload projects to and from the X models and it can be used with the HMI 5070TH and HMI 5100T as well. Using the Ethernet cable requires configuring the IP address on both the PC and the HMI. To configure the IP address on the HMI, click the arrow button in the lower right hand corner, select the gear icon to get into the system settings, enter your password, the default password is six ones, and on the network tab, Select IP address get from below. Enter your IP address and subnet mask. Now with a direct connection to a PC, the subnet mask 255.255.255.0 and no gateway is sufficient. When you have your IP address and subnet mask configured properly, select apply and OK. To configure the IP address on your PC, open your local area connection properties, select the Internet Protocol version 4, and select Properties. On the General tab, select Use the following IP address, enter an IP address that's compatible to the IP address in your HMI, and enter the subnet mask 255.255.255.0. Make sure the gateway is blank. A compatible IP address contains the first three numbers the same. In this case, the 192.168.1 matches the first three numbers in my HMI, and the last number, the dot .10, is different than the last number in my HMI, which is dot .15. With the IP address configured properly, click OK to exit. Connect the HMI to the PLC using the Ethernet crossover cable. Plug one end of the Ethernet cable into the RJ45 connector on the HMI and plug the other end of the Ethernet cable into the RJ45 connector on the PC. With the Ethernet cable connected and power applied to the HMI, open EasyBuilder 5000, save your project, compile the project, and then select Tools, Download, and configure the IP address for the HMI and hit Download. When the download process is finished, select Exit. If you get an error message while downloading that says, please check password and HMI IP, first make sure that you've got an Ethernet crossover cable securely connected between the HMI and the PC. Verify your IP addresses are compatible on the HMI and the PC. And also, make sure that the password in the download screen matches the password in the HMI. The upload-download passwords in the HMI can be modified on the System Settings Security tab. To upload a project using the Ethernet cable, Open the Project Manager through the Windows Start Maple Systems EasyWare 5000 directory. In Project Manager, select Upload. Select your HMI from the drop down list. Browse to a folder that you'd like to upload your project to and type in a name for the project. Enter the correct IP address and select Upload.
The uploaded file is a binary compiled file that will need to be decompiled before opening in Easy Builder 5000. To decompile the file, select Tools, Decompile, navigate to your XOB file, and select Decompile. When the decompile has succeeded, select Exit to close the decompile window and select File, Open, and open the decompiled file. For more information, please refer to the help file in EasyBuilder 5000 or visit the support center on our website at www.maplesystems.com.